Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got a tag video. I was tagged by Cherie at Just Nailed It. Um, she tagged me a while back. I'm just now getting to it. Um, so let's see. This is the Nail Care Routine Edition. So I'm going to reposition my camera a little bit and we're going to get right on into it. Okay, I just didn't want it to be like a bobblehead, you know, just the head. Just, Anyway, <laughs> this has got 10 questions on it, and I'm going to try to get on through this without losing my trail of thought completely. So, favorite cuticle oil. I don't truly have a favorite cuticle oil. I've used lots and lots of kinds. Like a lot of times when you place an order and you get like a set from Indie Makers, you'll get um, like a free sample or whatever. But if I have to go buy it, I like this California mango that you get from Sally's. The only thing I didn't like is you have to just brush it on. You have to, you know, unscrew the bottle and brush it on. And um, I normally pour mine into an old, you know, cuticle pen because I like those the best. But I don't really have a favorite cuticle oil. <laughs> Number two, favorite hand lotion. Well, during the day, I've got one of these at work. This is Palmer's. Um, Palmer Shea Butter Formula. I like this because it soaks in and my hands feel greasy. Plus, it smells good. Um, that's what I use during the day. Um, sometimes I'll have a little tube kind of like this in my purse of the Soap and Glory hand food. Um, that's what I tote around with me in my purse. But at night, and if I had to pick just one, at night it's this. It's the J.R. Watkins hand cream. And it comes in other scents, but I love the lemon. This stuff is, mmm, I love it. Glass or regular file? Well, I have a regular file. It's one of those eight-sided ones from Revlon, and I do use it. But if I'm really filing my nails, if I'm filing them, like, you know, doing some serious filing, I'll only use my glass file. And mine is a Germanicure, and of course, it's well used and loved. Um, if I'm doing some, like, filing back, because I don't, you know, I don't, I don't want to go mess my nails up. And I do have good luck with this one. So, and so I'm glad I didn't keep talking about that one, because I'd have blown number, question number four. Trim or file? I don't ever, ever use clippers on my nails, ever, ever. I use, um, files. I, you know, like if, I'm, if I've got like a really bad break and I'm having to take some serious nail back, I'll use this more coarse edge of the Revlon file and get it going and get it kind of where I want it and then I'll go in with my glass file. But I don't ever take metal clippers to my fingernails. Now my toenails, I don't care, but my fingernails, I just don't, I just, because when I clip mine with the C-curve I've got, it, if I clip over here, it could snap somewhere else over on the other side so I just don't do it. Nail care video. I have a nail care video on my channel. Um, it's somewhere back in the playlist. If I think about it I'll list I'll link it down in the description box. It hadn't been too awful long since I did it but if you guys want me to do another one I can. Um, not much has changed. <laughs> I'm a creature habits so um, but if you guys want another one I could do that one. Number six, do you soak your hands? I don't do it on a regular basis. Occasionally I will use a Manny Balm, but it's not so much really for my nails. Maybe it is some for around the cuticle area, but um, it's mostly for my hands. When they get just like really cracked and really funky, I'll use a Manny Balm that's just, and I know water is not good for your nails, but the Manny Balms have oils and stuff in it that just nourish and everything. And I don't make a weekly habit of it. Um, I'll probably use a Manny Bone maybe once a month. And it's kind of a treat. It's kind of like, you know, a treat. Um, number seven, gel or regular polish? I prefer a regular polish. Um, I am getting into gels and playing with gels more, um, mostly for the benefit of friends and family. Uh, and also just to, you know, have stuff to share on my channel. Um, I don't want to be just a one-trick pony. <laughs> so, um, and there, there are things you can get in gel form that, you know, you might not see in regular polish. So, but I love regular polish. Number eight, 
one piece of nail care advice. You know, I get asked a lot, what do you do for your nails? What do you take? What do you do this? Um, I'm, sometimes I take vitamins. Sometimes I don't take vitamins. Sometimes I drink a lot of water. Sometimes I don't. So those aren't really things that I think contribute to what I've got going on here. I think my best piece of advice for nail care um, is keeping them painted. I mean, my nails are not very strong on their own. But when you put, you know, five, six, seven layers of polish on your nail, I mean, it thickens it up. It makes it bulkier and more buff. You know, it can handle getting bumped into something a little bit. So, I guess that's my piece of nail care advice is keep them painted. I don't care if they're nubs. I don't care if you've broken some and you've had to take them all back to nubs. Paint them, paint them, paint them. Keep paint on them. Keep them painted. And number nine, my favorite part of a nail care routine. Um, I like having them cleaned, filed, everything clean, 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 clean palette to play on. Um, so I guess my favorite part is getting to start the next Manny, you know, getting getting all that cleaning and filing and cuticle work done and everything, having them ready, you know, right before you put that base coat on. That's that's probably my favorite part is seeing, you know, that blank canvas because I, I know the possibilities are endless. And number 10, three favorite nail care items you cannot live without. My, my J.R. Watkins hand cream, my glass file, <laughs> And I'm, I know that I didn't talk about this in the video, but I'm going to say my cleanup brush. Because it's, it's, a, it's a care item, too. Because, trust me, if I didn't get all that polish off my, uh, around my cuticles, I wouldn't be painting my nails as often. So, <laughs> those are my three. Um, I, do, I do also believe in cuticle oil. Um, <clears throat> but since I use this religiously, I, I, you know, if I go without using the cuticle oil, I don't, you know, I don't see any, like serious repercussions immediately from it. I'm sure long extended versions I would. So, <clears throat> that is my answers for the 10 questions for the Nail Care Routine Edition. Um, I hope you enjoyed this, especially you, Cherie. I appreciate you tagging me. And uh, I'm, I'm going to tag uh, Simply Kiwi for sure. Uh, how about Jody's polish? And let me think. I, there's so many. Um, I tell you what, if you haven't done this and haven't been tagged, I will leave these questions down below, and you can do it. <laughs> um, and if you want, to, and my regular subscribers, my regular friends, if you don't have a YouTube channel and you want to tell me some of your things in this, please do leave me a comment down below because I love learning from other people. Everything I do in my routine, I learned every single one of them from somebody else. You know, I um, can't remember who I learned this from. Wish I could, because that's my ride or die right there. So, that is it for me today. I hope you enjoyed this little tag video. I appreciate you dropping by and watching. And until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.